Well, tomorrow, the Urban League of Central Carolinas is partnering with Atrium Health to co-host a vaccination event to ensure equity and access to COVID-19 vaccines in underserved communities. Joining us live now to talk about it, Teddy McDaniel, the president of the, and CEO of the Urban League of Central Carolinas. Uh, who all can get vaccines at the clinic tomorrow? So we're, we're really excited about partnering with Atrium Health. And tomorrow, uh, all that are uh, available in Group 3 now, frontline workers, educators of all types, uh, and essential workers are, are eligible now, uh, especially with the people in Groups 1 to get vaccines. We'll have about 600 opportunities to get vaccines tomorrow from 8 to 4. Mm -hmm. Obviously, this is a targeted effort. How important is it to get these groups vaccinated? Uh, it, it's essential. I mean, we, we have unfortunately still some racial inequities, uh, and COVID-19 did nothing but exacerbate long-held inequities in black and brown communities. And this is our, our opportunity to provide access um, to vaccines. We've done some polling and research with the National Urban League, and we've now found that seven out of 10 African-Americans are willing to take the vaccine. And this is our opportunity to get the vaccine out to underserved communities. And this is really about saving your life. So we're excited about the opportunity to do it. Mm -hmm. So seven out of 10 willing to get it, the other three out of that 10. What do you say to those who are hesitant to get the vaccine? What do you, what do you say? We, we say that the vaccine is safe. You have to follow the science uh, and listen to those um, that, that have taken the vaccine. Uh, we wanna dispel these myths uh, about mistrust with the healthcare system. And with our partners and ambassadors, those that have taken the vaccine, we hope that people will listen, get the, get the vaccine as they can, and, and hopefully we can return to herd immunity at some point. All right, Teddy McDaniel with the Urban League, thank you for your work and thank you for your time this afternoon. Thank you.